Triple X main Lexan picture glue dries clear and flexible, allowing you to attach magazine or comic book images into your painting project, but still allowing them to remain flexible enough to use the body, unlike when conventional wood glues are used in a similar fashion. The items needed to complete a Lexan picture glue body are a comic book or magazine image, scissors, permanent marker, hobby knife, bristle brush, scouring pad, paper towel, Triple X main Lexan picture glue, water, and a clear body. After choosing the image you want to use from a magazine or comic book, you need to cut it out with scissors or a hobby knife. Take your time and cut the image out as cleanly as possible, since you'll be able to see any poor cut lines once you glue the image into the body. Spend some time to plan out the paint job you have in mind and the placement of the image to be glued in. Use a permanent marker to outline the image on the outside of the protective film so you have guidelines to help you line up the image once it comes time to actually glue it into place. Using an SOS pad or some very fine sandpaper, gently rough up the area where the image is going to be glued on the inside of the body so the glue has a stronger surface to bond to. You'll have to wash and dry the body again to remove any debris developed while sanding. Be careful when washing and drying the body not to remove the markings you made to help you line up the image. It is now time to glue the image into your polycarbonate body. Shake the Lexan picture glue well prior to application. Using a small bristle brush, apply a generous amount of the glue evenly over the face of the paper image. Don't touch the face of the image with your hands once the glue has been applied or you may damage the graphic. Once you have applied all of the Lexan picture glue, scoop up underneath the image and place it within the body into the desired position. Try to line it up as best as you can initially, but you can easily move the image around once it is in the body to match up with your alignment markings. Now that your image is in place, you need to gently pat and squeegee out any air bubbles, creases, or excess glue from between the image and the body using a small piece of paper towel. Be very careful during this process as not to damage the image that can become very fragile when moist with glue. Keep in mind that Lexan picture glue dries clear, so you don't need to remove all of it. You can use a small piece of damp paper towel to remove some of the excess glue from around the image, but again, don't worry too much here since the glue will dry clear. Let the glue fully cure overnight before moving on with the painting of the body. When painting the body, you have to remember that the image can still be a little delicate, so use extra caution when applying masking tape behind the image as not to tear it during removal. Also keep in mind that excessively dark paint can show through and darken the image, so you may want to do a slight backing with white or silver if you plan to paint with dark colors. Finish painting and detailing the body and mount it onto your chassis to wrap up your advanced project using Lexan Picture Glue. I want